The Chinese VT-4 main battle tank has successfully proven its capabilities in Algeria. During rigorous evaluations, the tank aced long-range firing exercises with a 100% hit rate. It showcased its endurance by driving continuously for 500 kilometers. It also demonstrated its ability to fire effectively under diverse conditions. This stellar performance didn't go unnoticed by the Algerian armed forces. Algeria, a major operator of the T-90 main battle tank alongside India and potentially Russia, depends heavily on these powerful machines. However, due to various circumstances, including commission losses in Russia since February 2022, Algeria's T-90 fleet dynamics have shifted. Reports indicate Russia has struggled to fulfill Algerian orders for additional T-90s for over two years. Tanks initially meant for export have been redirected to bolster the Russian army since 2022. Given North Korea's UN arms embargo and its nascent production of the Chanma-2 tank, Algeria has found China to be the only viable source for compatible main battle tanks. The VT-4 tank, sharing several technological and design features with the VT-5 light tank, entered service in China in the late 2010s. The VT-4 was specifically developed for the export market and has been acquired by countries such as Thailand, Pakistan, and, in smaller numbers, Nigeria. For Algeria, the VT-4 presents a compelling option to modernize its tank units and reduce dependence on Russian armor, especially given Russia's current limitations as a reliable supplier. The VT-4 tank is notably agile, boasting a 1,300-horsepower diesel engine that provides a high power-to-weight ratio. It features torsion bar suspension, an integrated hydraulic transmission system, and automatic gear transmission for seamless steering and acceleration. The tank comes equipped with composite armor and FY4 explosive reactive armor, offering about 700 mm of protection. Algeria is currently evaluating an advanced model of the tank, the VT-4A1, which features a hard-kill active protection system similar to the Israeli trophy system, complete with radar equipment.